believe what you see. I'm feeling pretty forged to have these cool Japanese candies right here in front of me. I gotta start with these. They're like some kind of gel in a little bag. What? Grape gel? Ooh, it's squishy. Kind of soft, kind of hard. How do you open it? Ah, no. Ooh, it's squirting it already. This I gotta try. <laughs> it's like a wet fruit snack, which is fine at first, but there's like a vinegary flavor to it. And it's something refreshing. Maybe this. I don't know what it says. Mmm. Hit the spot. What is going on with this horn? I almost made the video just about the horn. What is it? Look at it. Wafer? Cake? Is it soft? Is it hard? It's got a cool box. It's like a little messenger bag. Mm, look at it in there, all nice. Slides right out. Let's save some horn for later. Whoa, these are fun. They're hard. And they're full of hard chocolate. They're really lightweight. Oh, I can't wait to snap it. There it is. It didn't, um... Crack like I thought it was gonna go like... It smells so good. Mmm. Mmm. Horn's good. It's like a little... Chocolate taco. So I bought these Calorie Mate, thinking that they were these. But notice these are dark red and these are light red. Um, these are regular, original, kind of like butter cookies. These are um, maple, and they're grody. Um, I just wanted to talk about it. I'm not gonna eat them. Uh, I did review the original in my other Japanese candy review. Where is it? Is it there? Is it there? I think I also reviewed Picari Sweat and Fran. Uh, and they're both delicious. And I've already been enjoying this. Um, it doesn't taste like sweat. It tastes like um, Gatorade or um, Aquarius, if you will. Fran, we know it, we love it around here. Uh, it's like Pocky, but it's so girthy. I'll show you. Look at that Fran. This is double chocolate. I forget if I had um, single chocolate, milk chocolate last time. Um, but this is quite hefty. This is a stick, y'all. You hear that? Fran doesn't fuck around. Mmm. Two layers of chocolate. It's like three Pocky and one Fran. So much chocolate. Speaking of Pocky, um, these look similar, maybe? Pocky inside out? What? How's that work? Let's find out. Open it. Like they do in Japan. Mmm. Whoa. These are really cool. Look at them. Ah, oh, they smell so good. Like strawberry yogurt. Mmm. Dang. Look how fun these are. They're filled with strawberry cream. Let's see how it is. 
This smelled right. Hmm. It's cute, like it's cool, but um, ultimately it sucks. Uh, the whole fun of pocket is that you taste that strawberry fill in in your tongue. Mm. This is, you're mostly just tasting boringness, um, you know, basic cracker. Huh? You see, my tongue's touching the cracker, not the strawberry. Mm -mm. See? If I want to touch the strawberry, I gotta go in. In the hole. Like that. And I chew. We know it, we love it. What's better, high chew or starburst? Let me know in the comments. Please, please, let me know in the comments. There's a trick to opening them. Yeah. They look way worse than starburst. Starburst has like cool packaging. This looks like, I didn't even try. So it looks super sketchy at first. Um, it's, uh, so much more flavorful than Starburst, though. Oh god, the grape flavor, particularly. Never mind, it's not that great. It's not as good as I remember it. Um, I think the trick is you have to, like, suck on them for a while. You can't just, like, chew on them, like, Starburst style. And last but not least, we got a surprise strawberry cake. Mmm. It doesn't like strawberry cake, especially fun small ones like this. Look at it. It's like a little tiny, uh, cupcake, I guess. Ooh la la. It's so fancy. Japan, you really outdid yourself this time. Why does it say orange on it? Oh, it's so soft. Oh, look how creamy. Oh, you'll see no creamy. I'll get in there. Mm. What did we got? What? It's sud. Is it just cream? Look at that. It's like a little strawberry. Uh, shortcake. It's a little cake with a ton of cream. Do you like cream? I love it. Oh, the strawberry smell. Hmm. It's not that good, it's just a bunch of icing and cream, and it's, um... I feel like a lot of sweets and desserts and cakes and donuts in Japan are, like, not as sweet or something. There's, like, something funky about the way they, uh, are. Well, did you dig my bid on Japanese food? If you did, then be sure to smash that like button before you scram. And be my sub, please. Please click that subscribe button if you haven't already. As usual, it's a pledge, and I can't wait to do it again or else soon in another fun food review. Thanks for watching. Bye!